The goal of Evernote is to uh, is to make you feel smarter. So the Evernote lifestyle is uh, is making you effortlessly productive at work, but but also in your personal life. It's it's combining uh, everything that's important to you, uh, your professional life, your your student life, your work life, your family life, your food life, all together, and and making you be able to deal with the the flood of information overload that's coming at you from every direction letting you effortlessly deal with the flood of information to give you an elegant life. Evernote is our life's work. Uh, I, this is my third startup. Many people involved have made multiple startups uh, as well. And uh, we don't want to sell this company. We want it to be our company. We want to have a life's work. We don't want an exit. You know, a lot of, a lot of startups talk about an exit strategy. There should be no exit strategy for, for your life's work. But the key is to work on something sufficiently epic. Right? If you're going to give your life to something, it has to be epic. It has to be meaningful. You have to be on a quest. It has to be world changing. If you're doing something just to make money, if you're doing something because you think somebody wants to buy it, it's not epic enough. How can you devote your life to it if you don't really believe it? So that's the, that's the core, the, 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 the most important thing to trying to build a 100-year startup. Not a company that's, that lasts for 100 years, but a company that's still a startup in 100 years is to work on something that's your life's work that's sufficiently epic so that you can motivate the smartest people in the world to come and join us on our epic quest to make the world smarter and we can do it as our life's work for the next hundred years. Mm -hmm.